morning, everyone. We wrap up another week here on the old Nightcast broadcast. Brought to you tonight. Brought to you tonight by Phil the Philatelist. And yes, I still have hiccups. I've had them for over 24 hours now. And I'm thinking about calling up the emergency room. I don't know whether there's any danger. I was able to sleep la sleep last night. Although I did have the funkiest dreams. I, some of them I can't even tell you about right here. No, no I, I, this may come at a good time because I am going to take next week off. And we'll have some special fill-ins, fill in sluggos here who will be doing these night crap cast report, reports. Now let's wrap up the week with one of my favorite people, Phil the Philatelist right here on this night gas building and the National Hiccup Center. Hey! Uh, oh, I was going to say I may have got rid of them. Now here's Phil. There are dentists for Phil. Tired of paying outlandish prices for inferior grade postage stamps? Tired of trying to peel the backing off those government-made stamps only to find you did a halfway job? Long for the days when you had those regular stamps, not the self-adhesive ones, but the ones you licked yourself. Well, Phil the Philatelist has come to your rescue with his own brand of look-alike stamps, and you can get them at huge discounts during Phil's Philatelistic Forever Fair. Get stamps so good they'll confuse an expert and save money too. And unlike government-made stamps that come on sheets of 10 or 12 stamps a sheet, Phil's stamps are 100 to a sheet, and they're back with his special money guarantee. Remember, if you can't lick them, join them. Check out Phil's selection of stamps at every other 7-Eleven. And that's Nightcast, I'm Bob Whitmore.